hi guys welcome back to my channel today i'm here to talk about why female rabbits eat babies the first reason is if it gave birth to a dead rabbit it would definitely take care of that to clean it cannot leave it among the alive the living because it may rot and start you know smelling and attract predators so it will clean up the next reason why a rabbit will eat its baby or babies is if they are deformed babies if it sees that the baby is deformed or babies it may eat them because chances of survival are low these are animals this is how they take care of things another reason is if a dog is stressed it can still eat the babies that's why it's advisable to make sure that your your mother rabbits are kept in a in a you know a quiet place undisturbed so that they are calm because if anything stresses them they may react like that another reason like i said these are animals they don't behave like how humans behave okay so if a if a rabbit was sick if this mother noticed that one of the baby is sick or babies are sick it may do it as a mercy killing because they won't survive anyway i've not had much experience with this i've had i think uh, one or two cases and uh, the first case was the rabbit was was new on my farm and on my farm i had rabbits at home. i had dogs at home so that day when it gave birth uh there was a lot of barking i don't know why like at night the next day i woke up and there were babies but actually i was woken up by the cries of the babies so, so i found when they didn't have ears they didn't have tails they some were missing feet so this rabbit had come from somewhere where there were no dogs and then here there are dogs so a rabbit will eat its babies if it's threatened Okay? because these babies you know how babies are they have a scent so to protect itself at least and the future babies to come it will eat these babies if it's threatened not to attract predators so like i said make sure your rabbit is safe in a place where it feels calm now another reason may be if the hatch is too small and this rabbit may see it as um, a problem it may see as if they are overpopulated and it may take care of it may do some population control it may decide to you know reduce on the population so that they can fit in the cage another reason if a rabbit is having babies for the first time you know how it is the first time is not always so easy you know it may be stressful and the rabbit may not know exactly what is happening so sometimes a rabbit may eat its babies when it's the first time such a rabbit keep it around and see how it behaves the next time it has babies okay um if it happens again then that's a problem because if you see if you you, you can give it three chances if all three chances consecutively it is happening this rabbit eats its babies or gives birth to dead babies still born then don't give it any more chances remove it from your farm because sometimes this thing of eating babies is genetic if this rabbit managed to give birth and not eat these babies and then you rebreed among the babies you may find that some females also do it you get so this is not a good like if you're a breeder if you sell breeders it wouldn't be fair to sell such a rabbit with such a gene to someone else because it, it really is nagging to have a rabbit that keeps eating these babies so sometimes it is genetic if you find that it's genetic if it is recurring just know it's genetic don't breed the rabbit anymore if a rabbit sees that it cannot produce enough milk for the babies that it has due to poor feeding 
then it may have to reduce on the babies to make sure that some survive. It will do the picking and it will remove some babies so that it manages to raise some babies based on the milk supply that she has. So make sure you feed your rabbits well. This is mainly for the rabbits that are not handled so much by humans. You know, if, if you don't handle your rabbits so much, like if you have a big farm, or just you're not this person who loves to handle rabbits like me, like, and they don't know your smell, and then you came and touched their babies, when they, because rabbit may give birth uh, on the wire mesh, outside the nest box you may have forgotten to put the nest box you may not have known that the rabbit is gonna give birth so and you happen to touch the babies to move the babies the rabbit may reject them some rabbits may reject and just reject without doing anything drastic but some may eat the babies because your hands your your, your smell on the babies may indicate a threat okay so the rabbit may have to take care of that so avoid touching babies for this case you can you can first touch the fur of the babies to get kind of rub the smell is smell on you if it has plucked fur if not uh, use a cloth just make sure you don't touch with bare hands as i say use gloves just make sure you don't have a direct physical contact with the babies so uh another thing is sometimes you may if you see this when it has just given birth it may be because she's eating the placenta because we all know that if you don't find it in time when it has just given birth you may not know exactly when it has happened you may not find any blood at all anywhere if it is a very very clean rabbit and of course rabbits are clean all animals especially be dealing with blood because blood smells and attracts predators so all animals once they give birth they have to be clean totally not to attract predators so this rabbit will have to eat everything else that comes out apart from babies so that includes the placenta. So you may see it in action eating and you're like, oh, it's eating babies. When it's actually eating the placenta. So just be careful with that. Then also, people, like normally what I see is some farmers, like these people who mix rabbits, male, female, uh, mature, young, these people may come and be like, these males are eating the babies because they are trying to remove uh, competition. Bugs don't eat babies. They're not like some other animals I know that see babies as a threat because these mothers keep breastfeeding and for, for it, it wants to mate again, so it will eat the baby or babies. So that the mother is not breastfeeding anymore and then it can breed again. But this doesn't happen with rabbits. So don't start blaming your male rabbit for eating babies rabbits are not are not carnivorous they don't eat meat only the female rabbit does that and because of the reasons that we've seen above so don't go on blaming the male rabbit or other mature mature rabbits or even other females you may say the female is eating because it is jealous no please don't so if this happens on your farm Check through all the reasons as to why this may have happened and try to cross out and see and narrow, narrow it down to, to a cause because it is not a good thing to have on your farm. Alright, thank you for watching. Don't forget to comment, don't forget to share, don't forget to like. So many people have been asking about this so please share with your friends, tell them to come and watch and find out why this may be happening on their farm. See you in the next video.